I fuck go crazy. Yo, what is good, YouTube? It is your boy, Rur. I'm Kilfon, aka that boy Kilfon, and I'm back with another video. Now, today we are going to be going over layer packages. But before we start, I just want to say shout out to K for this merch, man. Um, you know, we going through some real hard times, man. We going through some real hard times, and you know, a lot of people escape is be video games and stuff like that. So, you know, it was it was real respectable of 2K to be doing this. Even though y'all could be doing a lot better in the gameplay aspect, we gonna get 2K this W right here. But if you are new to my channel, make sure that you leave a like on this video and you subscribe. Today, I'm going to be going over the layup packages. Now, when I say layup packages, I do mean every single one. I'm going to go into detail with every single one, basically, and I'm going to break it into three parts. The pros and cons of basically the jelly, uh, the euro step slash spin layup, and then finally the hop step for it. So when I say all this, y'all going to see I have the circus layup package on. Uh, I'm going to go through every single one. So this is going to be a pretty long video, but if you guys want to stick around, I am gonna probably show my top three or my favorite three at the end um, But I'm gonna be going through every single one of these every single one. So we're gonna start off with this default small Okay, now we back I just recorded this video like four freaking different times, bro And it was so long so I'm gonna try to condense it down as much as possible So instead of me backing out and showing you the layups, y'all just gonna have to trust my word for it So we're gonna start off with the default small as you see the layup package is okay it's okay literally as far as it goes with the jelly so like i said i'm breaking it up into jelly i'm breaking it up into euro step slash uh spin layup and i'm breaking it up into hop step so the first one is the jelly the jelly is okay it's just a simple little layup it's just a default it's literally what it sounds like default now getting into the euro and the uh, spin layup this does have a trash spin layups but the euro uh the euro step is very very fast that's one thing i can't say is good about this layup package but the hop step is terrible. The hop step is horrible. I would not recommend anybody to use this as far as it goes with the hop step. So getting on to the default swing, because I'm trying to I'm trying to go ahead and go quick so y'all ain't gotta sit here all day. Now, as far as it goes with the jelly, it's just like the default small. It does have just simple layer packages. It's nothing too special, nothing too crazy. But the Euro step is not as good as the default small, and the spin layup is not as good as the uh, default small either. The hop step is okay. It's not really something that's too special. It literally, it, it doesn't really do much, bro. It doesn't really do much. So that's all I can say about that one. Now, Circus. Circus does have some really jelly layups. If you are looking to just have fun in the park, I would recommend this layup package. It is one of those that it's like, it's just a fun little package to just throw on. Now, as far as it goes with the spin layup, if you don't know, this does have the between the legs spin layup. If you don't know what I'm talking about, just put this layup package on and uh, double tap your X button or your square button if you're on PS4 and uh, you'll see exactly what I'm talking about. It does have the, the between the legs spin layup, so that is one of the plus. So this is this is literally like the definition of a jelly layup. Now the hop step isn't that good. There are, ob there are obviously better ones, but this one is just, it's like, okay. Now getting into this floater specialist, this is the worst layup package out of the whole entire game. I don't care what nobody says, the hop step is trash, the euro step is so slow, the spin layup is so slow, it makes no sense how bad this layup package is. Now I'm not gonna lie, if people, like if you use this layup package, I'm sorry, like I don't mean to offend you, but this is garbage. I don't know how you use it, and that's all I got to say about this one. Fundamental is literally, it's, it's literally, it's ugly, like that's all I'm gonna say, it's, it's terrible. It's another one that is just ugly. The layer package, it has no jelly in it. It's just sometimes you do up like just just like simple hook shots or anything like that that you just miss sometimes and it's so stupid. Um, I don't know why I went to long athlete. Now, uh, like I said, it just does simple little like hook shots like that that is just so ugly and hideous. I would not recommend this one at all either. It's kind of like the Florida Specialist except Florida Specialist has the worst hop step in the game. Now getting into this long athlete, there is not really jelly with this one, but this one has the best, the absolute best hop step out of the whole entire game, bro. 
the best hop step out the whole entire game. If you are looking for that hop step that it literally takes you from the free throw line to the paint, it is this one right here. So if you're looking for the best layup package, I would recommend this one. This is probably the best one out the whole entire game if we're going off just basically hop steps. And hop step is something that you know you got to into uh, like incorporate into your game like at all times, man. So that's what I would say. This is probably the best one out the whole entire game. This is the one I'm always rocking with. This is the one that I'm going to put on actually right now. So uh, I don't have to ch go back and change it again because I was just changing and uh, seeing which ones was the best ones. Now, Jamal Crawford has a really good jelly layup. The hop stuff can get confusing. It's not that good. It is It is like it will throw your opponent off, but it's very easy to get blocked if, you, uh, if your opponent knows that you're about to do it. Now, I can say the Euro step is very clean. The Euro step is just like the circus layup uh, is very fast. So, you know, that's one plus. But as far as it goes, like the hop step and everything like that, this is just basically a jelly layup. Now, Steph Curry, I would say Steph Curry is good, but it's not like how it was the last couple of years. You do miss these layup animations. I have used this layup uh, before, and it was awful, man. You try to do a simple layup, next thing you know, you're doing a wrap around behind the back. Just like what he's doing right now. You're doing that layup, and it's just literally missing. And you're throwing it up, and you're doing floaters and all this other stuff. I just wouldn't recommend it, bro. Just leave it to Steph Curry. The only person that can do this layup package is pretty much Steph Curry. Um, George Gervin, he's more so, he has a little bit of jelly layups. Not that much, but his hop step is actually okay. Uh, his zero step is actually pretty good. Now, as far as it goes with the spin layup, the spin layup is just like a default one. Oh, and Jamal Crawford, I believe he does get the spin layup too, my bad. Uh, the between the legs spin layup too, my, my fault. Uh, George Gervin, he does have a simple little layup package. It's nothing too special. It's literally just like one of those that just gets the job done. Now, going on to James Harden. James Harden, I can sit here and talk about all day. This is probably so annoying of a layup package to literally uh, not defend, but to literally like, um, well, I guess you could say defend because it is so slow that it throws you off and it, it's very hard to time because you never know what animation that he's gonna do. Now, it is easy to get blocked if somebody's trailing you or anything like that, but if you are like right in front of somebody's face and you try to do a Euro step or you do like any type of layup like this, it is very hard to time when this, the ball is gonna release. I would say this is one of those layup packages that you have to be a special type of player to use. Um, the Euro step is okay, but it's very slow. Uh, you see all these animations, they're pretty they're, they're pretty slow, but you know, as time goes on, you know, a lot of people, they'll probably pick up on it and then they'll get to blocking you very easily. Now, Kyrie Irving, he also does have the spin layup between the legs, um, and he does have a quick, pretty quick Euro step, but he has the worst hop step, and I mean the absolute worst next to Florida Specialist. The absolute worst hop step uh, out of the whole entire game. I don't know. I, I use this layup a lot because just because the little jelly layups, you know, when I'm trying to do it on like the twos and stuff like that. When I got a new player, it's very helpful. It's very helpful because uh, the layups, they won't get blocked as easily because a lot of people, you can't time it just like that James Harden. But as far as it goes, if you're trying to hop step with it, it is horrible, bro. It is horrible. Now, getting on to LeBron James, this is more so just a, a get it done type of uh, thing, just like the George Gervin right there. He does have some cool little layups, not really nothing too jelly, but you know, just just a simple get it done. Uh, a lot of the layups are just basically get it done, like the fundamental and you know LeBron James and George Gervin, and uh, I believe Ben Simmons is one of those too. Now, I will say that the hop step is okay. It uh, it just it's simply just a regular hop step. It's not really nothing too special. So, I mean, you could use it if you want to. If you know LeBron James is your favorite player, you can go ahead and use it. But like I said, I recommend using Long Athlete for all of them. Now, Michael Jordan has the most jelly layups like out of the whole entire game. But the only problem is they are so, so annoying when you don't know what you're about to do. Because you'll go up for a dunk. Next thing you know, you're doing a whole layup and it gets so annoying. I would not recommend using Michael Jordan unless you're literally just like playing for fun at the park and stuff like that. But if you're like any type of comp games, any type of rec games and stuff like that, you're going to get blocked. Especially if two people are jumping at you, you're going to get blocked. Um, ben Simmons, he has a cool little layup package. I wouldn't recommend it, but he has a cool layup package. His hop step is actually pretty good. It's not bad at all. It's not bad at all. His hop step is actually not bad. His zero step is actually not bad. His spin layup could use some work. It is pretty slow. But it, overall, it's like a probably like a six or seven out of ten. Um, Russell Westbrook, he does have some very very quick layups. 
now i'm not gonna lie this is more so if you're a contact layer uh not contact if you're a contact layup player like you know you like in contact on the way to the rim and you know stuff like that this is more so your thing uh a lot of these layup packages they don't actually activate it's just one that it's like it's super quick that it's like it get, takes you all the way to the rim and i recommend people like actually i wouldn't say use this but i would say that if you do use it i would say make sure that you point your right stick towards the rim a lot just so that it's a the one of those uh quick layer packages because if you get any of the other ones they are pretty slow and th he'll do like as you see like he'll do like one of those contact layups that you know it's like it gets very very annoying uh and it'll be very easy to get blocked so overall i will say long athlete is probably my favorite and then uh for jelly i will say Kyrie Irving. that's probably my favorite one and if we're going between the legs and hop step and stuff like that uh i'm going with circus circus is actually a pretty good one because the euro step and the uh spin layup is actually really good but i'm gonna go ahead and show y'all this little long athlete real quick you know what i'm saying the little hop step that i was talking about and then we're gonna go ahead and this video but it, before i end this video make sure that you do leave a like on the video and subscribe for more you know little info videos and stuff like this so you know i'm gonna go ahead and show y'all this real quick you know you got that it looks a lot slower right now but man when i tell you when you get in game don't mind that cold spot when you get in game g this hop step is so cold it's so cold it takes you so to the it takes you to literally to the rim especially if you have on slithery finisher it's ridiculous um but this being your boy real i'm kill fun aka that boy kill fun and hopefully you guys did enjoy this video if you did make sure you leave a like on it and subscribe to the video follow me on twitch and my twitter um and i will catch y'all in the next one peace Look, can you see the eight? I've been in the darkness of my heart and it ain't safe. I ain't really here, but I know that it's okay. Cause I die, don't drown. I can walk across the lake, these.